Hello, darlings. You've all heard of Marilyn Monroe. Some of you know Bridget Fardo. Well, now it's time for the cognac show. I said cognac. Ooh, ooh. I said cognac. Ooh, ooh, ooh. I'm a bubbly blonde, fabulously dressed. with Holly Gordon, yes. That's now, tell my audience, how did you meet Holly? Uh, I met her, she was uh, organizing a talk over at the Photo Photo Gallery. And I was so impressed with the talk and her that I came back the next day to learn more about the Photo Photo Gallery. And we just hit it off so well, became friends, and I said, hey, why don't we use this wonderful space here and, and put a show on it? And you do such a fantastic job over how many pages? How many? 38 photographers. 38 photographers. Mm -hmm. And that. And what, what, we, what are we seeing here in this gallery? How many pieces of photography art? Oh, probably. Oh, goodness. Wow. It's 38. Probably about 125. Wow. Over that. Yes, quite a bit. That is very impressive. Yes. Very impressive. And you love, you've fallen in love with this space. Yes, I have. Yes, I moved out here from West Virginia, and I live in a very rural area on top of a mountain. And so I moved out to Patchogue in March of last year, and I love it here. So many nice people and the beaches, and it's a beautiful, beautiful town. It sure is. Yes. Uh, tell my audience, how many pieces right now are being exhibited with your name on it? Uh, I have uh, one large grid, and I have a large uh, 26 by 36 photograph. So I have two pieces, but the grid consists of 15. Oh, my goodness. Explain that to my audience about that particular piece of photography. Uh, that was taken in the city. I was uh, I did spent a lot of time doing reflections, so I see reflections everywhere. And I was in the city, and... There was a wonderful building on the corner that sold coffee and I think desserts and all the people walking by this metal building. So I photographed the people as they walked by and it created all these abstract images and this imperfections in the uh, chrome or metal in the uh, dings and scratches in the metal. Fascinating. What do you love when you take a picture? What do you look for? Something that fascinates you? What fascinates you? Uh, I love the experience of it. Uh, when I take a photo, I could be there for hours, 
and I love the whole experience of getting lost in it. That's how I tend to work is I don't just, you know, go to an image, take a photo, I stay with it. You stay with it, and, and after the process of taking the photo, what's involved in making it look so special? Uh, well, I do my own printing, and I have an idea of how I want it to look, and so that's basically what I do. I also come from a background of painter in the mm -hmm. past, so I think that plays into my photography. So your own photography is more artistic. It's, yeah, I, my, my influence in painting. Wonderful, wonderful. Now, tell my audience, if they want to learn more about you as an artist, as a photographer, do you have a website? I'm in the process of redoing a website, but if you Google my name, it's A-L-E-T-A, D-O-R-T-E-S, uh, things will come up. And they'll Facebook, be are you on Facebook? Uh, yes, I'm on Facebook as well. And any other galleries? Do you, are you showing your work any other galleries? Uh, well, I've shown in a few galleries around here um, at the, uh, the Long Island Arts League and then uh, another gallery which Dave put together at one of the universities here. Isn't he a wonderful curator? Yes, he, yes, he is. He's, he's a gallery manager. He's quite, quite good at what he does here. He certainly yes. is. Yes. Alita, I love your name. Thank you. What does it mean, your name, Alita? One with wings. It's a beautiful name. Thank you. And I want to thank you so much for talking to me right here at this beautiful art gallery, art space in Patchogue, Long Island. Give me a kiss. Uh, and thank you for coming. We'll be back in a moment, dollies. More interviews coming up right here at art space in Patchogue, Long Island. Big champagne kisses. I'm Cognac Lane, and we're here at Art Space in Patchogue, Long Island, and I'm here with this fabulous artist himself who plays such beautiful music. Introduce yourself to the camera. My name is Julian Morgan. I am 17, and I attend Pat Med High School. Tell my audience how you found out about this event. Um, my, my friend Gerald, he, uh, attend, like, he lives here, and he just told me about it, and he said I should come by and play a little bit. Well, this is a fabulous art gallery and your music is just perfect for oh, a gallery you. such as this. Tell my audience a little bit more about your music and how you came to, why you are such an artist as yourself. Tell my audience, explain to my audience a little bit more about yourself. I mean, I feel that I need music. Like I just, that's like how I live. Like it kind of like runs through me. And when it comes to music, I don't kind of, I don't really read off the piece of paper, I just kind of play it, and that's how I do it. Really? Yeah. Now, where did this love come from? How old were you when you started to love the music? I mean, did you go to school for it? Did your did you parents have an instructor teach you how to play the piano? Well, when I was around six years old, my brother and my sister started playing, and I thought, why not? Why shouldn't I play since I was like, since I like kind of looked up to them? And then, as I grew up, they stopped playing, and I just kind of stayed with it. And look at me now, I, can, I mean, I love piano. I can't really think I can do anything else, so. <laughs> now tonight, what did we listen to? What was the music you were playing in the background? I really don't know the name for it, I think it's just me. It's just you, combining and collaborating, think, a whole bunch of stuff. I think I can say jazz and classical music. Mostly jazz, though. Okay, very good, okay. Now, tell my audience, where is your next gig going to be? Where? I can't tell you. I think it just happens. It just happens? It happens. Do you have a website? No. As of right now, no. Do you have a Facebook page? Yes. Tell my audience. You can find me at MusicNote123 on Facebook. What about Instagram? Oh, Julian underscore Morgan. And that's it, yeah. We'll be back in a moment, darlings. More interviews coming up right here at Art Space in Patchogue, Long Island.
Hello, darlings. You've all heard of Marilyn Monroe. Some of you know Bridget Fardell. Well, now it's time for the cognac show. I said cognac, ooh, ooh. I said cognac, ooh, ooh, ooh. I'm a ballet blonde, fabulously dressed to impress. It's been a Cry Baby Productions, darlings.